McDonald's, Winchell's Donuts, IHOP. They're just some of the brands that we all grew up with and indulged in with friends and family. But did you know that they were all made in California? Food historian Chef George Geary joining us now. He wrote a brand new book that tells the stories of the iconic businesses that got their start in the Golden State. Chef George is here to put our California knowledge to the test. So first of all, Chef George, good afternoon. Welcome. Good to see you both. Thanks for having me. And uh, I was surprised when I put the book together that there were this many California uh, food locations. In fact, this is only half of them. We have to do a second version to keep going. So successful. I love to see Big Bo Bob's Big Boy Elias Brothers. I used to love going there because we could see his big face, you know, <laughs> <laughs> like so yeah. many family memories at so many of these places. What a great book. Oh. And take pictures out front of yes, the big Bob. I I have or that. if you were in some high schools, you stole Bob and put it on your gymnasium. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what was it like going through our state from top to bottom, George, and sort of finding out all of these little nuggets of history? But it, it was fascinating to find like uh, different kind of history things that. Uh, that you could win at Jeopardy if you get this book because they're going to use some of these answers in here. And I want to play a game with both of you because I want to see how well you do in okay. California food history. Just do you so think you know. can make it? I ate at a lot of these places, but I'm from Michigan. Now, California is Heather's home oh. state. So I'm thinking that she might win, You're but I'm going to try my already, best. Are you? I'm not. I'm just going to oh. I'm just going to say. Okay. <laughs> well, we're here with the bells and we're ready to go. So, Chef George, what is your first quiz question for California? All right. California? The first question. Hopefully you both remembered Swinson's ice cream. Yes. Okay. Uh, there was a bunch of them all over the country. There's oh, yes. still only three left, but they made strange ice cream flavors. Is it true or false? Was pucker up pickle one of them? <laughs> oh, um, go Heather. I'm going to say false. Okay, I'll say true. <laughs> eh, wrong answer. It's true. It's true. That was ah, I mean, wrong I answer for team, team Heather. Thanks, Heather. <laughs> okay, next question. Next one. This is pretty good because this has a little Michigan thing to it. Oh, okay. In 1919, A&W Root Beer mm -hmm. was founded in Lodi, California. What else did they invent? Did they invent onion rings, root beer floats, oh. or bacon cheeseburgers? I'm going to say root beer float. I'm going to say onion rings. Uh, it was bacon cheeseburger, <laughs> a guy in wrong. Michigan, one of the guys there. Darn it. Okay, number so, three. Yep. All right, you said Bob's big boy. Oh, yep. here's a little Bob. I love him. True or false, there's still 10 locations in California. Ooh. True. Hmm. False. The answer is false. There's only three. The There's only boy. three. There used to be one on it. It was like Starbucks. What happened to Bob's? Big yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Which you you both have We're to get this. Which well burger together. company started in San Diego? Wait. Carl's Jr., Jack in the Box, or Fat Burger? Jack in the Box. Yeah. Yep. They're down the street from the studio, they are aren't right they? Right down yes. the street. Yeah. And our favorite. Yeah. So you better have said that one. <laughs> okay. One more burger question okay. that I love. True or false? The McDonald brothers were caddies in a golf course oh. before they opened up their McDonald's. I'm going to say true. I'm going to say false. Yep, it was false. They owned a theater. Ah. And they reused the usherette uniforms to have car hops use them. Ah, so they reused their clothes. See, that's a Do you have a tiebreaker? I think we're tied right now. Yep, last question. Let's see if you can get it. Okay. Who's going to win? Which of these companies were started by women? Oh. C's Candy, Fat Burger, or Marie Callender's? I'm going to say C's. C's Candy. Yeah, everyone thinks Mary C started it. It was just her recipes. Her uh, son really started really? it. Really? So what was it, Marie Callender? No, it was the sun again, did Marie Calvers. <laughs> it was Fat Burger. Okay. Fat burger. Well, you know, strong sons yeah. are born from strong moms. So. This is true. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Clearly, That's Heather right. and I exactly both need right. to buy our book and read it, because I don't think we did very well. I think I think we'll both go to lunch and, at one of these places <laughs> and, and enjoy our success together. <laughs> hey, George, by there the way, go. I love the review on the back of your book. Um, somebody said, I gained 15 pounds reading this book, but it was worth it because 10 of those went to my brain. So there's a lot of good information Aww. packed inside yeah. this book. That was really a nice review, wasn't it? I think it's fascinating, <laughs> too, to see how much success the Golden State has had. Absolutely, and I have the exact address of where their very first location was, and is it still operating or not? 
That's neat. That would be like something for someone to do during, you know, if you still have a little time to kill during the pandemic, you could go take a tour through the state and go to all the first locations of these restaurants too. Yeah, see if they're still there. Yeah. Well, it's number 15 as far as books from you, Chef George. Can't wait to see you back in person because you and I need to get into another whipped cream fight. I'm oh. ready. <laughs> Somebody asked me if we were going to have whipped cream on the show today. <laughs> I've interviewed him before. Miss you all. snuck messy. some to me, Chef George. Yeah. I would have lopped a dolly over it. <laughs> over it. <laughs> Chef George, thank you again. The book is called Made in California. Keep up the great thank work. Thank you. We hope to see you soon.